if the Russians were so against this airstrike and they knew ahead of time that the U.S. was going to hit, why didn't they use their um, air defense system that they have there in Syria? They have an S-400 there that they put in Syria that can detect um, and intercept air missiles when coming there. If they were so against the American strike, why didn't they use their air defense system? Well, I, well, I'll try to answer your question if I can, but before I, I want to I wanna ask a question. Mm -hmm. Does this mean, Saba, that the fact that this airstrike took place, that Vladimir Putin is now commanding our military and telling us when to fire and when to hold our fire and telling us what targets to choose and what targets not to choose. Now, is that the question? And are people who are now agreeing with me in the, in the Congress that actually Vladimir Putin is now commanding our armed forces? That's question number one on this matter, because we all know that's exactly yes. what took place. Yep. That's exactly what took place. Yeah. And so that, the answer to that question, Sabbath, answers your most uh, piercing question. If they knew in advance that 59 Tomahawk missiles were coming in, why did not they use their air defense system to stop those Tomahawks from doing any kind of damage, except that this was a collusion, right. this was a plan that was put together, and this was, we now have Vladimir Putin manipulating our, our armed forces and telling us when to shoot and when not to shoot. I never, never thought I'd ever live to see such a day as this wickedness as we now find going on in our nation. Unbelievable. Yeah, it, it really is unbelievable. And the, just the thought process alone is more is scarier than we even imagine when you think about the kind of hold that he actually has on this administration. And he ain't going to give it up anytime no. soon.